we read about these numbers in the news, we might have asked ourselves, why should I care? How can they affect me personally? Actually, these numbers impact our lives in many ways. The final value of goods and services produced within a country for a period is called Gross Domestic Product or GDP or Gawa Dito sa Pilipinas in our case. Before the COVID-19 pandemic, GDP reached 19.4 trillion pesos in 2019 after growing for 21 straight years. A growing GDP can create more jobs and improve our lives. We always hear about inflation. It is the rate of change of the Consumer Price Index or CPI. The number that represents the average price of a standard basket of goods and services consumed by a typical Filipino family over a period of time. When prices are stable, there is low and stable inflation, even if the CPI steadily increases over time. As price stability is the primary mandate of the Banco Central ng Pilipinas or BSP, it regularly monitors developments relevant to inflation so that it can take appropriate action if needed to keep it low and stable. With price stability, goods and services remain affordable. Among the factors that can influence inflation is domestic liquidity. Domestic liquidity or M3 as regularly reported by the BSP refers to money supply consisting of currency in circulation, deposits, and deposit substitutes, such as promissory notes and commercial papers. As money influences the demand for goods and services in the economy, not enough money or lack of liquidity can constrain economic activity, while too much money or too much liquidity can lead to excessive demand and inflationary pressures. Therefore, the BSP closely monitors this number to ensure that it stays within a range that supports economic activity but does not lead to high inflation. Reported together with domestic liquidity are data on bank lending. One of the drivers of money supply growth are people and businesses applying for loans. Firms and households borrow money from banks to finance their production and consumption needs. Gross domestic product, inflation, domestic liquidity, and bank lending. These are just some of the domestic indicators compiled or monitored by the BSP. These numbers tell stories relevant to our lives. To learn more about these and other indicators, please visit our website at www.bsp.gov.ph and follow us on social media.